What are the pages that you should have on your website for your online business? This is a question that people complicate way too freaking much. Like there are only a few pages that you need for your website. And in this video, I'm gonna show you what those pages are, why you should have them, and then how to put them together on Kajabi. This is actually day three of your first 30 days on Kajabi, a new series that I'm doing where I am showing you step-by-step step exactly what to do to build your business and start making money quickly on Kajabi. If you're not already on Kajabi, you should go to lanesebring.com slash Kajabi, which is my link. You get a 30-day trial and you get my three bonuses. You get the Kajabi Accelerator course, which will walk you through step-by-step step how to get the best start on the platform, set everything up, get it ready to go. And you're gonna get my exclusive masterclass, which is the top three mistakes that new Kajabi users make that I discovered helping 400 people get their start on Kajabi. I've learned a few things. If you can avoid these three mistakes, you'll be well on your way to success. And you're gonna get my 25K course launch email template. All of that is yours when you use my link, lanesebring.com slash Kajabi. Now, if you missed day two and day one, go check them out. They are called your first 30 days on Kajabi. We looked at the Kajabi dashboard as a whole. Yesterday, we looked at Kajabi website templates, and today we're gonna look at Kajabi website pages. So how you access this is you go over here to website, you go down to website pages, and it's gonna give you these options. First is the home page, and we talked about this in our video yesterday, and I gave you the example of the home page that I have right here, which is, lanesebring.com. And what I mentioned is that my philosophy on online business websites, websites that are designed for online business, is that really the point of the website is to get people from the website to your email list. In other words, your website, every page on your site should function as a lead generating tool. And so anything that's not generating leads or generating sales really is not necessary. It's just a distraction. And so this is why when you go and you make your home page, make sure that it focuses on the free guide, free resource, free lead magnet that you have. I put this together to show you what a home page should look like. So write a headline that shows the value of what you do and captures the interest of your target audience. So up here, the value of what I do, by the way, I don't wanna get off of this too quickly. Kajabi also has these. This is where it you somebody's trying to exit the page and this pops up and says, hey, before you go, get your free guide. So again, it's trying to drive leads. And if somebody clicks on that, it takes them to lanesebring.com slash super simple to get that guide. So here is my headline. I help you replace your nine to five income with a thriving online business without hustle, grind, or having to build a large social media following. By the way, that's what I do. If you're into that kind of thing, be sure to subscribe and watch more videos because I'll show you how to do just that here on this channel. So use this text to further present the value of what you do by pointing to your lead magnet, the free PDF, the checklist, the resource, et cetera, and give a call to action to download it. Be sure to include the name of the resource and make it compelling. You will continue promoting the benefits of your lead magnet down this entire page. And so here I have first benefit of the lead magnet, second benefit, third benefit, and then uh, with the lead magnet cover on the right, which is this right here, use this text to ask a compelling question, something like, are you ready to change your situation, improve your life, et cetera, by downloading this free resource. So this is like a template that I have used, that I've put together based on what I do, that will help you along the way. So before, you can really get going with this. You have to make your lead magnet, which we'll talk about in subsequent videos, but you can at least get the website pages ready. Now, Kajabi makes this super simple. You'll notice that when I click on things over here, there are kind of the building blocks of it. This is just a little photo a graphic that I did on Canva of a light bulb. And then I put the title first benefit and then the text here. And when you put this into your site, this is kind of what it looks like in a real site. The light bulb, choosing the best niche, so that's the title. 
Here's the text that goes with it. So this is kind of the end result of this template. Now, once you have put together this page of the, the home page, you gotta think about what are the other website pages? And when I say website page, I mean the kind of standard pages that go with it. You're gonna have a thank you page. This is what is going to be shown after somebody opts in to one of your lead magnets. We'll talk more about the thank you page later, but it, the standard thank you page is just gonna say thank you, your free guide or whatever is on the way to your inbox. Your store, um, the library of your courses, the page that people log in, uh, the blog page and the blog search, like these are pages that we'll get to when we talk about the blog. Now, when you hear blog, don't think like only just written content. For our purposes, the blog is going to be your latest content. So I always think that your content should, should exist on platforms where your people are hanging out. So for example, my people are hanging out mostly on YouTube. They're going to YouTube and they're searching for how do I make money online? How do I start an online business? How do I get started on Kajabi? Is Kajabi the best tool? How do I use Kajabi? Is Kajabi better than this other tool? So I'm on Kajabi making content. My website, the blog feature of my website is really just to highlight some of that content. I don't put all of it on there, but it's some of the content so that if somebody is on my site, they can see, oh yeah, this person, he isn't just, he didn't just make a website and walk away from it. He has content that he's regularly updating, putting it out there into the world. So that's how I see that. In terms of the actual pages that I have on my site, I have the blog page, which I, I mentioned here, which are just kind of some recent pieces of content. I have courses. So again, when you think about your website, it should either turn people into leads or customers. This is one of the ways that I turn people into customers. So the main course, Six Figure Fastlane, this takes you to the sales page for Six Figure Fastlane. Now this is actually a landing page, which we'll get to in tomorrow's video. But for today, uh, this is just what we're looking at here. It's just the page under courses and then coaching, one-on-one -on -one coaching with Lane Sebring. And that is right here. Try Kajabi for free. This is uh, another landing page, which we'll talk about yesterday. I mean, we'll talk about tomorrow, um, but this is a landing page that I have. And then uh, there is the login for my customers. So all that is, is there. And I hope you can see that it doesn't have to be complicated, especially when you're first starting out, go through some of the website pages that you need, like perhaps, of course, a home page, a blog if you, if you wanna keep your content up to date, courses if you have them. And then down here at the bottom is where I would put stuff like your about page, your, you know, I don't even have an about page because I don't feel like I need one when I say everything I wanna say here. What I really want is not somebody clicking through every page and reading everything about me, not that they're even interested. What I want them to do is to say, oh my gosh, I want this guide because it's gonna help me. So I'm gonna click there and get the guide. Speaking of guides, I put together a workshop that is gonna be perfect for you as you're going through these 30 days. It's called the Turn What You Know Into Dough Workshop. And it's the four steps to making your first $1,000 a month in passive income online in your spare time. So between your 30 days on Kajabi and building your online business on Kajabi, it's going to give you everything that you need to know to hit the ground running, and it's totally free. It's an amazing workshop. I've put a lot into it. You can find that for free on demand at lanesebring.com slash workshop. Go watch that. Be sure to sign up for Kajabi at lanesebring.com slash Kajabi. And tomorrow we'll dive into your actual landing pages and sales pages on Kajabi.